Thinking of moving to the Atlanta metro area? Have you heard of Sonoya, Georgia? Hey y'all, this is Living in Coweta. My name is Ben and I am your licensed local real estate expert. Stick around because today I'm gonna to give you just a quick overview of Sonoya, Georgia in Coweta County and just touch on some of the highlights of this incredible area and why you should live here. I'll be coming out with a new video every week talking about Coweta County and other suburbs of Atlanta. So be sure to subscribe to my channel and be on the lookout for where I will be next. Also, leave a comment on where you'd like to see me in future videos. Let's get into it. Just an hour drive south of downtown Atlanta in the southeastern corner of Coweta County sits the charming city of Sonoya, Georgia. In 2019, it was ranked the safest city in Georgia by SafeWise. So with small town life is what you like, but with some modern comforts, Sonoya just may be the town for you. In fact, Sonoya, Georgia was home to a little over 5,000 people according to the 2020 census. But the cost to buy a home in Sonoya is not always cheap. In 2023, the median cost of a single family home was $555,000, which was $135,000 more than the entirety of Coweta County's median price point of $420,000. While driving around Sonoya, you may recognize several backdrops and homes used in films like Driving Miss Daisy, Sweet Home Alabama, Fried Green Tomatoes, and of course, the hit TV show, The Walking Dead. Be sure to stop by Georgia Tour Company in downtown Sonoya on Main Street to take a tour of where these films were made, along with other movies and shows, filmed in surrounding areas such as Smokey and the Bandit, Stranger Things, and several productions of the Marvel Cinematic Universe. While you're in downtown Sonoya, be sure to drop by one of the amazing restaurants like Nick and Norman's, co-owned by none other than Norman Reedus of The Walking Dead. McGuire's is another great dining experience if you enjoy the taste of the Irish. Not hungry? Just want to enjoy an adult beverage? How about stopping by the Sonoya Beer Company or Pearl and Pine Brewery? Did you bring the family? Then Main Street Fudge and Ice Cream Shop is definitely the place to go. And of course, after you're done, walk it off on the rest of Main Street, taking in all the great local shops. If you really love everything that Main Street has to offer, the best part is, is you could even live within walking distance. You've not only got historic Sonoya homes that in 2023 had a median sales price of about $485,000, but you also have the Gin Property Community. In 2023, the median price for that community was $780,000. But the Gin Property is a very unique property. You're not just buying a home, you're buying a home that was once used on the set of The Walking Dead, where you might know the community better as Alexandria. After filming wrapped, the homes were renovated, including fresh paint and refinished hardwood floors. Sonoya, Georgia is primarily located within Coweta County, with certain parts of the city extending into neighboring counties like Fayette and Merriweather. This has significant implications, particularly concerning school districts. In the Coweta section of Sonoya, the high school district is East Coweta. In the Merriweather portion, the prevalent school district is Greenville High School. Meanwhile, in the Fayette County area, depending on the location, parents are either sending their children to Stars Mill or Whitewater High School. I always suggest doing your own research on schools to determine which district best aligns with your specific family needs. As a parent myself, I can assure you that none of these options would disappoint you though. Speaking of schools, Sonoya is home into one school in particular, the Coweta Charter Academy. It is a public charter school that you can apply for enrollment that serves kindergarten through eighth grade. There's no tuition and I saved the best for last. For 2023, Niche.com ranked Coweta Charter Academy number one in two categories for the entire state of Georgia, best public elementary school teachers in Georgia and best public middle school teachers in Georgia. Currently, Niche.com ranks Sonoya as the number two best place to buy a home in the Atlanta area. And although Sonoya has been established for a long time and has several well-established neighborhoods, it is a booming city with several new construction neighborhoods popping up everywhere by well-established builders in the area. 
Some examples of popular new build neighborhoods in Sonoya include Standing Oaks by Trademark Homes, Fieldstone by Jeff Lindsay Homes, and Saddle Ridge by DRB, just to name a few. The best part about new construction homes are right now, in many cases, the builder will offer incentives to encourage buyers to purchase with them. Incentives could include the builder offering to contribute to closing costs, and also in a few instances, to buy down the buyer's interest rates. Reach out to me to find out what current incentives are being offered by the builders in the area. I am just beginning this channel by introducing different areas, but please be patient and I will start to get into the trenches and start to show you the inside of these beautiful new construction homes. In the meantime, reach out to me for a private in-person or video tour of any of these beautiful homes. With all these homes quickly popping up, Sonoya is still catching up on some aspects. Sonoya did get a large in-town option for their groceries in 2021 though. Publix proudly opened their doors and is now a huge convenience to the residents of Sonoya. But many of the other shopping options are on Main Street in downtown Sonoya, and most of those are small locally owned shops. So if you're looking to do a little more than some boutique shopping, you'll need to travel to either nearby Peachtree City or Noonan. I already talked about Noonan in past videos, so be sure to check out those. I'll put a link at the end of this video for you. And as for Peachtree City, it is super unique. The high-end shopping options abound in Peachtree City, but I'll be filling you in on that city in a future video. So again, be sure to subscribe. But to give you an idea of how close Sonoya is to everything, from downtown Sonoya, it's just under 30 minutes to Ashley Park in Noonan, and it's 20 minutes to the Costco in Sharpsburg, and it's only 15 minutes from the Avenue at Peachtree City. Now that you've got just a small taste of what makes Sonoya, Georgia such a great place to live, are you ready to consider making a move here? I'll be happy to get you from where you are to where you wanna be. My contact information is below and in the description, so reach out anytime. I'll be coming out with new videos every week and I'll be diving in a lot deeper. So be sure to subscribe. Be sure to hit that like button too. And also if you are interested in seeing other Metro Atlanta areas, comment below. This channel may focus on the Atlanta suburb of Coweta County, but I will be venturing out to other surrounding areas as well. All right, that's it for this video, everyone. See you next week.